Welcome to Glasgow, with thousands of restaurants from fine dining to street food, and ranging from everything from Japanese to Mexican to Italian. This is a food lover's paradise. In this show, we will be taking regular folk and putting them up against the hardest food challenges the city has to offer. This is Man vs Scran. Hi there, I'm Alistair, I'm 32 and I'm an actor and I'm here at Kit Yoshi's to attempt the Guinness Cup Buster Challenge. I want to attempt a food challenge because I've always watched like Man vs Food and a bit of Food Network and always thought it would be fun to give it a bash. Out of the challenges that were, that were offered, this one looked like it might be the easiest to, to take down. Uh, the challenge looks fairly easy, which means it's probably going to be very difficult. Um, and I am not confident whatsoever, but let's go and give it a bash. Yes, you aren't filling me with much hope here, Alistair. Kitty O'Shea's is an Irish pub situated in the heart of Glasgow, right next to Central Station on Waterloo Street. They have live music, sports, and daily food and drink deals. We're here for their famous Guinness Gut Buster Challenge, featuring a double patty chili burger, a full rack of barbecue ribs, six inferno hot wings, and a mega portion of chips and cheese, a side of coleslaw, and a pint of Guinness. The meal is 20 pounds, but if you can defeat this challenge in 20 minutes or less, it's completely free. Okay, Alistair, ready? On three, two, one, go! Here we go. So, how are the ribs? They're so spicy. Promising start. Ribs are pretty good. If the food tastes good, then this could be easier than you thought. Excuse me. Oh, charming. Okay, so you have just over 10 minutes left. What? Just over 10 minutes? Oh, no way. Less of that, Alistair. This is a family show. Hiccups are starting, man. That's not a good sign. Oh, so you decided to stop eating with your hands. Oh well, never mind. Are you okay, Alistair? You seem to be struggling a little. Fat wall. Not good. Keep going, don't give up now. Final 10 seconds now. Down that pint. Wow! My mouth's still full. That was a terrible attempt. Well, there's a lot of food left over, but at least you gave it a good shot. So how do you feel after the challenge? I feel quite full, if I'm honest with you. Um, a little bit defeated, but for the, my first ever food challenge, I'm, I'm quite proud that I managed to at least take down one thing on the plate. Would you recommend other people to come and try this challenge? If you're off your head, then I go for it. I'm not a professional uh, eater um, by any sense of the word. So I think a lot more practice on my part needs to be done to prepare for something like this. But you know, it's... It's, it's worth a shot if you, if you fancy giving it a go, definitely. Well, unfortunately, Alistair failed today at Kitty O'Shea's, but tune in next week for a whole new food challenge. Join Jamie as he goes to Taco Mazama to tackle their triple-sized burrito. Mm -mm. I don't know if I can do this. 